like a million Yeah, my bad be like a million Girl, show me why you really done Yes, it's your boy DJ Big Ass there with the man like Biggs
bricks from Atlanta. Yeah. Okay. I'm supposed to do so. Okay. Um, how did you get that link? Fab. Okay. Yeah. For, uh, how, how did that connection kind of come? Like, did you just hear the um, music? Like, yeah, he heard it, but he was coming down for um, his show. Was it Drake's tour? Okay. Mm -hmm. Obviously, we got whatever we had to get to to get into that show. Yeah. And, um, we just linked up there. I met Bricks there. Yeah. And then yeah, we just hit the studio. Who is the biggest person that you kind of been gas by that like, that was into That's your music? Stuff. Because like a lot of people have shown that they're into your music. So like, who was the biggest person that gassed you up like you thought, rah, I'm reaching there. Um, I want to gas by like, you might appreciate it when you know that people that Ed share it. Like, okay, just call it that. Yeah. Boy, so you gotta get a little gas with Ed, you know? Yeah. Kind of, Ed, in my opinion, probably top three musicians from the country for the past yeah, few years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if he, if he reaches out and says, Jim, I like what you're doing, yeah, that's gotta really. be a good look. Nah, gotta be a good look. Appreciate that, still. Man. Is there anybody that you'd like to work with that's, that's big that you think, yeah, man, that could happen if I make an album? Ed, man. Ed, Ed. Ed, Ed. Okay. Ed feature. How would that drop? Would that drop like a. Like a one for the radio, or would that just be you doing you? Me doing me. Yeah. And then just go global worldwide, due to the fact that the music will be appealing and rap, mm. not just because it's Ed and Cole. Yeah. yeah. You get me? The music has to be rap. Mm. I'm not gonna go in the studio and record it. Then. If the tune's not right, I won't. Let it come out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Do you know what yeah. I mean? Like, I, was, I was passionate about the music. Is do you ever go back to like old tunes and think, well, you know what? Better than half for the man than out here tunes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't even gonna say that. <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, like, I can't lie. There's, there's a couple of tunes. Yeah, like, yeah, I was like, bro. I wish I could have done that. But it's like, you know, sometimes it's good to sit on something. Yeah, you know? I agree. Like, I really, agree. I did that two years ago. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I did that right after done talking. Okay, okay. Oh, I was like, wow. I like the tune so much, let me keep it there. What was the biggest gem, one of the biggest gems that you can actually say on camera that you learned from 2018? Um, first of all, number one was just stay humble. Okay, mm. that's the main thing. Stay humble. Two, your work process has to be. On point. What? Yeah. yeah. Hard yeah. work. Yeah. Hard work and dedication. And consistency, because that's one thing you have been. Yeah. Even though you've not dropped a project, you've been consistent. Exactly. The songs after songs after songs. You've always been a band in the club. Yeah. Yeah. You've always like you've always kept it kept it bubbling, man. And you know, I can see the kind of the humbleness to be honest with you. I can't see no jewelry, and I'm not saying that. Because it's that's like nah, nah, but I didn't probably uh, hold you. Know, like, some man just stay there and jewelry. Some man just like, tell my man them that. Cause some, some of my niggas are like, what code? Why are you not wearing your jewelry like yeah. mm. so You don't wear it on a moon day. Yeah. I'm not there wearing jewelry on a moon day for you. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Jewelry's there too, you know, just, it's part of your, you know, your outfit. Yeah. 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 You wear that on special occasions. So, so. Let's talk early influences. Yes. Yeah, because your style, even on the mixtape, you show me things like versatility. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, oh my god, like these are tunes here, yeah, like I can really play to like big people. Yeah, 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 like. yeah. So let's talk about your style because it seems to be massive. I'm half Caribbean, half African. Okay. So I know. Yeah, okay. My mom's Ghanaian, my dad's Dominican. Okay. Bro, so like, you know what? I thought you was full African, nah, you know? Nah. I just thought you've just implemented the reggae yeah, team, the bashment team yeah, to yeah, the yeah. team. My dad's yeah. a full roster. Oh, okay. yeah. 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 It's like from oh, early on. That makes sense. That makes sense. The Caribbean yeah. man, the reggae is in that. Yeah. Early mm. plus the African, you know. And just mixing it up with the British dialect mm. just makes it unique. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, any bashment artist that you'd like to work with if you had the opportunity? Oh, no. Vibes. Yeah. Why it's got to be possible, Carl. I don't know how Style OG got to work with it. Everyone's working with Fire Drive, right? He's the go-to guy. I don't think his presence is changing. No way his presence is changing. You know, listening to music and you know, just reading around and seeing things, you can see that, like, you know, you see to be someone that is from, is real, <coughs> from, yeah, yeah, from, yeah, from the ends, someone that we can relate to. 100%. And we want to see you be successful. We don't want to yeah. see you end up where other people are ending up. That's why like when we see 
when you said 2018, you sat yeah. back and analysed. We're glad that you yeah, did yeah, that, yeah, yeah, so yeah. that you can kind of have that longevity yeah. and get Seriously. what you deserve. Exactly. Right? Because a lot of our artists ain't getting what's yeah, not supposed to be getting because they're not doing the business right. Yeah, yeah. I think, I think that's 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 what you just said to me is something that, that man's been saying to my people, you know? Because certain people weren't doing the business right. Yeah, mm. so that, they ain't got the right people around like, them. Man. The UK scene, we haven't had the light shone on us like this. Yeah. So it's all new. Yeah, man. It. But it's like, I, I don't know how to say it, but we're getting carried away with what's going on. So it's like certain shit that's happening. Yeah. And, yeah. It's like it looks... Sketch it looks sloppy, man. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah, yeah. I mean? We should be like the Americans. Moving yeah. forward, man. Yeah. Everybody at the same time. Mm. Yeah. I, think, I think it's your people as well. you got anybody in your, around you that's like your own people that came from the hood with you, that's, that's put on doing doing Everyone. business management role tours, whatever, whatever. Everyone. How do you feel yeah. to be able to bring yeah. them and them with you and them on tour? Because like, as we come in, we were saying that you're yeah, too much. Nice I was loving like, it. You see, you're out there doing the sound check. And you got the man, and, and yeah. you know, you've created this. Like, yeah. You're the first person I've ever seen do a sound check, and have all the man that's there just singing along. And, and this is just a sound check, this ain't the show. Yeah, this ain't the show. And that's why I said to Big Oss, like, yo, my man looks like he's living his best life. He's got the man them here, they look like they're doing big things. Imagine. Seeing you on the stage doing big things. Oof. I even seen you, oh, I don't know if I can say it, but he was on the stage doing this one thing when he's like, When you see yourself in the next ten years, like ten, yeah, it's only got about five. Nah, because you know what? Five years, like you can still be talking again. Yeah, but ten, 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 it's gonna be like, ten, like it's gonna be eight and nine. When you're gonna be in ten, ten years, ten years, gonna be one of the greatest artists on yeah. this earth. Not even just the UK on this earth. Jeez, you know what? You can't believe it. You know that. Yeah. The way that you're heading right now is more than possible. Yeah, definitely. So before we finish. We're in January 2019, yeah. like, what, what's it saying for you, man? 2019? Yeah, we're trying to do, man. Yeah. I don't want to talk to you. Who said that? I'm talking. Because if that was the mix, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> say, 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 no. say, 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 now you've got yeah, Smino, yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, now you've yeah, got Smino, like, if somebody yeah. ever rips the audio from one of our shows wow. in the next couple of months and sends it to you, just know that, yo, yeah, yeah, yeah. yo, yeah, yeah. the Golden Boy mixtape was yeah, a yeah. madness, yeah, so if you're saying that was just a mixtape, yeah, I definitely can't wait for that album, yeah, come and I don't even want to know when it's going to be out, no pressure, yeah, I just want to, I just want to keep, I just want to keep, you know what the music is, we can allow you, yeah, why could it come true with the mixtape, plus my Yeah, yeah. Cheers! Yeah. 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 Yeah.